Hello everyone, let's talk about God being a distant God. Now if you're not a Christian and you're on this site, please don't be offended. You're welcome to watch. I hope you pick up something from this and we can all be kind to one another. Sometimes God seems distant. I find myself, whenever I'm praying to God, really feeling that. I guess it's because it's always a one-sided conversation. I don't hear His voice. And because I'm human and I can be selfish, I start questioning why he hasn't given me the things that I've asked for, even when they're things that I know that would please him. You see, sometimes we get caught up thinking that God is like a dispenser. We ask, he provides, we're appreciative, great deal. But unfortunately, many times what we ask for is not the best thing for us. Also, if God were to give us everything that we asked for, if he was very active in our lives, then it would only be fair for him to also be active in penalizing us whenever we do wrong. Few of us want that, right? Our God has decided, for his own reasons, to be distant. He's given us his truth, his word, his love, all of the things on this planet to use at our disposal, but most of all, he gave us eternal life through Jesus Christ, our Lord. That's enough. It's natural for us to want more though, and to say, well, why aren't you just blessing me? Be thankful that he's not penalizing you also. I do believe God does bless us. I just think that with our limited understanding, patience, and desires, we don't recognize the blessings. So, whenever you feel like God is a distant God, remind yourself that that could work to your advantage. He chooses not to condemn you for all of eternity for the things that you've done, so long as you accept Christ as your Lord and Savior. So, not only is he your judge, but he's provided your eternal salvation. And that's a very wonderful, not so distant God, right? When that God comes to this earth and dies for all of mankind's sins, allows himself to be put on a cross. That's quite personal if you ask me. So, ask God for the things you need. Trust in him, but also realize that he's not a vending machine. But that's good, because it means you're not under his um, micromanagement. Thanks for watching, God bless you.